This is a story using tangrams. Now tangrams, as you can see on the diagram, there are seven of them and these are called tans. These tans can be shaped together to make animals or people or numbers and they were used by the ancient Chinese to tell stories to their children. The story I am going to tell with the tangrams is called the fox hunt. In this story the fox is chased by the hounds and creates a stir as it tries to escape. The fox hunt. The hunters were mounted on their horses waiting for the horn to sound. By thy side were the hounds straining at the lead. The horn sounds and the chase is on. Soon the hounds find the scent of the fox and begin to follow it. The fox runs away as fast as he can, chased by the hounds. The fox runs into a wood and disturbs a squirrel which quickly climbs up a tree. The hounds are getting closer and as the fox leaves the woods he scares a rabbit which runs towards his hole. Up above a hawk sees a rabbit and swoops down to catch him. The rabbit is too fast and manages to escape into his hole. The hounds are closing in on the fox and he runs through a farmyard. A goose and a chicken think the fox is after them and run away making lots of noise. The farmer hears a commotion and runs out of his house. He sees the fox and chases after it. The fox runs as fast as he can. He runs across the stream. The dogs lose the scent and the fox disappears safely into the woods. The hunt is over and the fox has escaped. This time Tangrams are really good for children. They can use them to build figures or houses or animals or numbers, anything. They can use their imagination if they want to, but there are plenty of examples on the internet where they can see shapes they would like to build. Thank you for watching this presentation of Tangrams. I hope you liked it. If you did, perhaps you would pass it on to your friends. Thank you.